Hello parents. And before I begin, I want to thank you for choosing the Tucson Unified School District. Thank you for choosing Tucson Unified Schools. You are our most powerful partner. And I want to thank you for trusting us with your most precious gift, your children. It's for that reason I want you to know, as your superintendent, there is no priority more important for me than the security and the safety of your child and our employees. And today I want to talk about aspects of our security that make Tucson Unified one of the safest school districts in the entire state of Arizona. I join you in being saddened by the national trend of continued shootings in public places and the loss of so many lives. And though we can't control these patterns of random violence, what we can control is the extent to which we are prepared as your public school district. And one of the strongest steps that we have taken this year to make sure that we are prepared, we have increased the amount of days each school year that we will be doing safety and crisis drills for our students' employees. We have changed our policy language to increase from two days of emergency drill planning to four to ensure that all of our student body and all of our employees are as, are as prepared as possible in the event of any crisis or emergency. It's basically when we're dealing with emergencies, seconds count, we know that, but we also know that we only have one chance to get it right. So we need to be trained up right. That's gonna look like um, uh, three emergency drills, uh, which will be lockdowns, and then a fourth one every year, which is a shelter in place, which is basically designed for a weather-related emergency or something like a chemical spill. We're doing two tabletop exercises where they can go hands-on and actually do the work um, through a, uh, a act of violence at one of our schools would be the scenario. And we're also gonna talk about after-hours emergencies, and we're also gonna talk about the key area of a off-site evacuation and a reunification. Another important aspect of our overall security and a strong measure that we have taken for the 1920 school year is to increase the amount of training and professional development that our counselors and our principals have with regard to crisis and emergency planning and preparedness. We will be requiring an additional two to three hours of training every single month to ensure that the principals and the counselors are thoroughly prepared and confident and competent in the face of any unexpected emergency. Not all of the measures and the steps that we're taking to improve the overall security of our district have to do with training or have to do with policy changes. Some of them are economic. And one of the strongest steps that we are taking is an increased investment financially and economically in the improvement of the security infrastructure of this district. Uh, one of the uh, great examples of it is the recent increase to fencing at Borton Elementary School, which gave us the ability to keep the children safer when they're out in the uh, desert area environmental center behind the school. Also, we are looking at district-wide surveillance system, and going hand in hand with that is access control, which is our door card readers. And the big uh, thing here is not just the fact that we can turn that card on and off when we need to, but it also gives us the ability to lock all those doors automatically in the event of an emergency. Last year we completed a project to put um, door cameras uh, in each of the schools so at the entrance they can look through the phone and speak to someone at the door and vet them and make sure that they have legitimate business in the school and then they can let them enter through the door. You can expect to see more projects of this nature improving the overall security infrastructure of our district in the immediate future. Lastly, and what I think makes us distinct in the world of security, is the fact that Tucson Unified is the only district that has an armed school security force. We're a team of 30 dedicated individuals who work around the clock, and we are uh, deployed every day in uh, patrol cars throughout the district. So that gives uh, us a better level of protection and service to our school community to quickly respond to the um, security needs or the safety needs that we have around the clock. I hope that you've enjoyed this brief video about all of the security measures in place in the Tucson Unified School District. And I thank you again for choosing Tucson Unified Schools. My hope is you feel better and stronger about your decision to trust us with your child and that you're better informed about all of the steps that we have taken and continue to take to make sure that all of our children and all of our employees are nothing less than 100% safe and secure while under our care.